Hi guys, just with a response to the question that's on next to me over here, number six. So what we were looking at was how do we go about solving this? First thing we need to think about is how are we going to work out what we're being asked to do? So we're going to need to look at deal A. We're going to need to look very carefully at what we're doing. So deal A, $12.99 is the total cost of the three books. So we need to find out how much each book costs. So we'll do that with $12.99 divided by three. Deal B is £38.16 for nine books. So we'll do £38.16 divided by nine. Deal C, right at the end over there, is five books for £25.60. So we're trying being asked to work out what £25.60 divided by five is. Just going to switch my camera around and I'll show you how to work these out. OK, I've written my three questions down. Now I need to go about solving them. So first things first, I've got 12 nine and I'm going to do that three I look at my first digit I can't divide one by three that's going to be a zero I'm going to exchange my one across I'm now dividing 12 by three so I can work this out three six nine twelve there are four threes or four lots of three in twelve I need to remember my decimal point because we're talking with money here. Nine, three, six, nine. So I've got three in there. The same again in there. So in this one, in A, each book is four pounds thirty-three. We'll look at B next. Thirty-eight pounds and sixteen pence. So we do exactly the same. Thirty-eight. 16 remembering the decimal point because we're dealing with money divided by nine i've got the same problem i can't divide three by nine that will be a zero there i'm going to exchange the three i couldn't divide to my next column so i'm dividing 38 by nine so 9 18 27 36 i can get four lots out so four nines I've got two nines left over, or sorry, I've got two left over. So 36, add two more to make 38. I'm going to exchange those across. I'm now looking at 21 divided by nine. So nine, 18, 27, no, 27 is too big, so it's two. So 18, I've got three left over. I exchange that across. So I'm now dividing 36 by 9, which is 4. Let's just check 9, 18, 27, 36. So each in deal B is £4.24. We'll look at deal C next £25.60 for five books. So exactly the same again. 25, don't forget the decimal point. There, we're dividing by five. Two divided by five, I can't do. So I need to exchange that up. 25 divided by five, so five, 10, 15, 20, 25. There's five, lots of five in that. My decimal point goes in. Six divided by five, I can get one lot of out of there. I also have one left over. 10 divided by five, I know two fives make 10. So there you go. The answer is deal B, this one here. That's the best deal out of those three. I hope you found this useful. Let me know in, your, in the comments. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.